Well, we are learning about a new proposal in Massachusetts to update gun control laws. NBC 10 Bristol County News Chief Jody Reed gauges the local impact. Massachusetts currently has some of the strictest gun laws in the country, but cities like here in Fall River continue to be plagued by gun violence, an issue that public safety officials believe is caused by untraceable guns, also known as ghost guns. We don't want any more shootings or people playing with guns that aren't licensed in the city of Fall River. This session, House lawmakers have filed a bill that would crack down on the illegal trade of ghost guns, a problem that police officers say has become more prevalent over the last few years. It would enable them to really get after what we're seeing on the streets with these, these illegal firearms kind of flooding into our downtowns. Um, it, would, it would allow them to conduct proper investigations as to where these ghost guns are coming from. The bill also aims to amend some of the state's gun licensing requirements, something that the bill sponsors said is actually supported by legal gun owners. We heard from a lot of responsible gun owners that the code on the licensing side of things was complicated. It had been layered over multiple years. The bill also calls for more education around firearm safety, an important tool to prevent youth across the state from accidentally discharging a weapon. Well, I, I think most parents that own guns do store them properly, but if they are criminals and they're not licensed or they have ghost guns around the house, uh, they, they can't in any way, shape or form have a, access for those to the, their children. The proposal still needs to be approved by the House and Senate before it can become law, but the public will have a chance to weigh in on it first. A public hearing on the matter is expected to be scheduled this fall.